Hey guys, I uh, got some mail call basically I want to go over real quick with you guys. Uh, first off, I want to uh, look at this uh, from Annie's Smoking Pot. Annie's Smoking Pot, she sent me a sticker. And the uh, last video I saw of her, she's having some health issues and stuff. Um, so I don't know, uh, if I remember right, she's not going to be in for maybe a little bit. Um, but uh, yeah, our thoughts and prayers are with her. She's a great channel. She does all kinds of recipes. So uh, if you don't know her, definitely get over there and check out her channel and support her. Uh, she's put a note in here thanking me for her support. So that's really awesome. Appreciate that, Annie. Uh, I want to send out uh, some of my stuff to you as well. So uh, give me a minute and I'll, uh, I'll get that uh, going, okay? Um, also, Anthony Gambler812. Uh, he sent me a couple of CDs. I knew about this one, uh, Blue Interlude from the Wynton Marcello uh, Septet. Uh, basically, this is a, a, an album that he came out with one of the first, what I would call maybe longer tracks. Um, uh, just, just one of those things that he kind of started doing. Uh, before that, it was just standard jazz pieces that wasn't, uh, you know, just near normal normal length um the one that comes to mind for me is the bittersweet saga of sugar cane and sweetie pie let's see that that's right here um it's really cool jazz album you guys know i like Wynton marcellus i love Wynton marcellus and uh anthony had showed this on a fine uh, some of his thrift finds he had and he actually mentioned me and uh said hey if you want this holler at me i said heck yeah that'd be great in my collection um, I don't have this. I've listened to it several times on Apple Music. Um, so, uh, yep, very nice on this one. And then he surprised me with this one here, guys. I was just like, ah, oh, you, you can't believe, I can't believe. This guy knows me really well. Um, he put in the letter that he knew I would enjoy this, and he is definitely right. This is one of them. I just love this film. I think from 1985, I believe. Uh, there's the tracks. Uh, produced and arranged by David Foster. Um, he's uh, arranged and produced music for many, many, many people, uh, famous uh, people, great pianist. Um, man, what a great movie from the 80s. Rob Lowe, Emilio Estevez, uh, Andrew McCarthy, Demi Moore, Judd Nelson, Ali Sheedy, uh, Mayor Wingham, Andy McDowell's in this as well. Uh, Jenny Wright, uh, she has a couple of appearances in here as um, Rob Lowe's uh, wife. And uh, I, I don't know if you guys have seen this movie or not. I think it was cool. It was really awesome because the other night, <laughs> for the first time, my wife watched this. So we found it on uh, one of the streaming channels. Um, and uh, we watched it for the first time. And uh, and it, like I say, it was just really cool. 80s. And so anyway, Anthony, I really appreciate your brother on this, um, man, uh, just awesome, awesome stuff. Um, I do, of course, you know, guys, I'm doing vinyls and I've got picked up tons of CDs here lately. Um, as a matter of fact, I went thrifting yesterday at our local thrift store and picked up some CDs. Uh, so you can see tons of stuff. We got. George Jones' Greatest Hits, Conway Twitty, The Best of Conway Twitty, Yanni, Live at the Acropolis. I've got another copy of this, I think, somewhere. So if somebody wants this, I'll definitely send it to you if I have my other copy. I, man, I'm, I, my stuff is so unorganized, but I'll look. But I, I think I have this still. Another great uh, album, Yanni, Nightbird. I have never purchased Michael Buble. Um, but I've listened to a few of his tunes on Apple Music, and so I got the CD. All these were a buck a piece, by the way. One dollar a piece. Piano Memories. Best Charlie Pride. Now, I'm not really too much in country music, guys, but some of the older country music I really like. Um, there's a Luciano Pavarotti. Anthony, dude, if you don't have this and you'd like to have this CD, dude, just comment man just tell me hey yeah i'd love to have it if you already have it great uh, live on stage i found this and 
and uh, always think of you. Um, I have several Pavarotti CDs and a few albums, um, and uh, listen to them every once in a while. Kenny G Live. Did not have that one. Got a couple of his albums. Now, this is interesting. I really wanted this, uh, Mamma Mia, because it had some cool, cool tracks on there that I know I would love. But <laughs> inside of it, it had the greatest showman. Uh, this is pretty much a mint condition CD. There's no hard, ain't nothing on it. Um, but I've been eyeballing this vinyl at Walmart several times. It's one of my daughter's favorite musicals. And I thought, what the crap? I'm just going to get it. Uh, I'm not going to keep it, of course, in this case. I'll, I've got some cases. I'm just going to have to make me a, you know, a insert or whatever. Oh, what else? I mean, I found all kinds of stuff, guys. Mary Chapman Carpenter. Really don't know much about her. I, know, I mean, I know the name, but before I, when I was in there looking through the albums and stuff, I listened to a few songs of this. Thought it was really good. Thought I'd give it a try. Uh, don't know much. Matter of fact, I don't even know this. Seems like I've seen uh, this advertised on Stars possibly here re recently. Is why I bought it. But um, I looked at the, some of the titles. Uh, look at Brenda Lee, Ray Charles. Percy Faith, there's just several uh, good tunes on here, I think, uh, but I'm going to give it a listen to, put it in my collection for a while, and this was, this is just kind of a thing, I, they gave it to me for a dollar, uh, Super Driver, original Truckers Tape Magazine from November 1995, looked like it cost $9.95 at that time, comes with two cassettes, insert so I've never seen this before uh, so uh, right now my Pioneer stereo system is in Tulsa Oklahoma at a repair shop uh, they've had it for about four weeks now and they keep on telling me yeah the other gonna holler at me when it gets done and then I really wasn't gonna go over these in this video guys I was just gonna thank Anthony and Annie, but I've got these kind of handy from yesterday, so I'll give it a shot here. I bought this album here, Shirley Bassey, This Is My Life. Um, I, she kind of sounded familiar to me, but I looked at this tune up and listened to it, and I, I didn't really recognize it, but this looks like a pretty good album. To me, that one song sounded nice. Um, I love the Eastman Wind Ensemble and uh, Frederick Fennell and Philip Sousa Marches. Goodness, I, I think this is going to be a great album. All these albums are in really great shape. Jerry Lee Lewis, Old Time Country Music. This was a dollar. It says this was in some used record store, obviously. I see this all the time in record stores. Very good plus to very good $3, but uh, I got it for a dollar. And it's in, it's in really good shape. It still has the shrink wrap on it. Scott Joplin with Dick Hyman playing piano. Maple, Maple Leaf Rag uh, is very popular. Wall Street Rag, I remember that one. I mean, I remember I've heard it before. <laughs> I wasn't alive when it was written. The Entertainer, of course, that's a popular one. So I'll be looking forward to spinning that. really don't know this album is in really great shape i think the woman on here is just extremely good looking um so what's new mercury records i, I thought i'd pick it up and try it out i mean it was only a dollar and it's in excellent shape and like i said i love pictures or covers from this uh time period guys it's really a really neat it's, like i said it's in great shape and we have oh Sorry, I knocked you around a little bit there. Exotic guitars. Those were the days. Uh, I know Autumn Leaves. Um, of course, the Sound of Music. A Man and a Woman. Blue Velvet. Taste of Honey. I know all those tunes. So, uh, be looking forward to spinning that. And then, 
the one and only Andre Previn on piano with his orchestra. Uh, this is in shrink wrap. I'm in the mood for love. Stella by Starlight. That old black magic. I, I know. I know every, every one of these actually. It's easy to remember falling in love again. So I'm gonna be really looking forward to that. So that's it in a nutshell. That's my thrift finds. Wasn't really planning on putting that on the this on this video, um, but also Annie. Again, thank you so much. Really appreciate that. And my brother Anthony over at Gambler Eight One Two. Awesome, 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 guys. Appreciate you all. See ya.